Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today, I will introduce you to a power supply with constant voltage and constant current function. It will be a reliable and compact LED driving circuit. The circuit uses common components, I believe you will succeed the first time you do it. Normally, we usually use a constant voltage source to power the LEDs. This way is wrong, this will lead to the LEDs easily burn out and short life. The correct way is that we will use a source with a constant current to supply the LEDs. As shown in the video the current set is limited to 50 mA whether the load is 2 or 3 LEDs. You can use this power supply to charge batteries or drill batteries, with a controlled charging current. I will guide you in detail on how to make this circuit, after the sponsor's advertisement. These are custom 3D printed enclosures from a $1 service from JLCPCB. By 3D printing, your enclosure with JLCPCB, you can create a finished product experience for your hardware. Price as low as 7 cents per G. Step 1, upload your 3D files. Upload your CAD file online and select materials to get an instant quote, price starts from $1. Step 2, 3D printing it. Our industrial 3D printers and professional operators will produce your prototypes and end use parts with the highest quality. Step 3, delivery straight to you. JLCPCB 3D Printing Service covers a worldwide delivery, we will ship parts to your doors directly from our 3D printing factory. Here is the schematic diagram of the circuit. Thanks to Aka Kazian for sharing this circuit. You can visit the author's YouTube channel in the description for more details. Basically 220 volts AC is rectified through 4 diodes to 310 volts DC and stored in 22 UF 400 volts. Power IC TNY267 and transformer EE25 will convert voltage from 310 volts to 12 volts. The output current and voltage are controlled by the ICLM358. The constant current or constant voltage working mode is shown through two LEDs. The output voltage and current are regulated through two fine-tuned potentiometers. The output diodes and capacitors are used for voltage rectification and smoothing purposes. When the load is not connected, the circuit will operate in constant voltage mode, when there is a load, the circuit will operate in constant current mode. This printed circuit is designed on Sprint Layout software. You can download it in the description of this video. Here is the printed circuit sent from JLCPCB one week after ordering. Now I will show you how to wind a transformer. This is the transformer EE25 with the parameters as shown in the video. Because the circuit works in flyback mode so I will make a gap of 0.2 mm inside the transformer.
For the primary, I will wrap 140 turns with 0.3 mm diameter using enameled copper wire. Four layers of insulating tape are used for insulation between primary and secondary. For the secondary, I will wrap 23 turns with 0.5 mm diameter using enameled copper wire. Here is the final result. Thanks for watching my video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you next time.